hello you guys welcome back to my channel big chicks and fit beauty gang what's up what's up with y'all i'm looking I'm looking rough because I don't know who told me that this silk press was gonna last. And I'm really not trying to put nothing on the front besides my edges so that like if I want to switch up the style, I don't have to deal with all the extra stuff that's in it. So let's just bear with the hairstyle today. So I'm about to get ready to go do cardio. I woke up late, per the usual. It's almost that time of the month, so I've been very, very like tired, sleepy. So I'm sipping on my Oxy Greens right now. Y'all already know the drill just to get my good going, my immune system where it needs to be for the day. I'm doing the Oxy Greens. Now we'll create picking up the wrong thing. Oxy Greens, I told y'all this is my little corner. I'm doing Oxy Greens with my glutamine for good support, for natural detox for sec de for natural detoxification. Let me slow down. For the actual detoxification and to boost up this cardio to make sure that hey we getting it in i'm going in with my l carnitine and i'm about to take my oxy sure y'all so i take this every morning just to get my body going and then when i get home i'm gonna cook breakfast and i'll show y'all what that is so let's go ahead and do this cardio when i come back y'all my hair look like at about a seven right now hot mess right but when i get back it's gonna be like a four by like how real hot mess so i just want y'all to see that it don't always look at this and if i took it down it's really like big and curly can't work out like that but yeah i'm gonna show y'all when i get back what it's gonna be looking like and then we're gonna get ready for breakfast i usually don't do faster cardio but i'm running behind i ain't got time to be late if i don't go at 10 it ain't gonna get done so with that being said i need to be walking out the door right now so talk to y'all later y'all i absolutely look crazy but oh well okay like sometimes you just gotta show up how you show up and that's this how i showed up to the gym so now i'm trying to figure out what i'm gonna do to my hair because i do have a party to go to saturday and i get my hair done monday so it, i'm in a bind right now but anyways it's time to eat breakfast so it is 11 45 it's giving intermittent fasting but that was not the plan like my plan was not to intermittent fast I just want to get my workout done and not be too late because when I'm late, I'm off track. So, I'm about to make one of my OG breakfast meals that I literally was eating all throughout prep. And it kind of just reminded me because usually, like, the breakfast I be eating, I be cool, but I be literally hungry within an hour. So, I was like, when you eat something and it don't really keep you satisfied for a long period of time, I mean, it really just not as full, like, as nutritionist as it should be. So, by making sure that you pick certain meals to make you feel more satisfied, especially when you know your appetite big. Like, with me, my appetite has been huge. And, fun fact, if you did not know, your BMR increases when you're on your cycle. So, it's a little normal to feel a little bit more hungry. So, with that being said, I'm going to show y'all what we're doing. So, we're going to do a roasted potato, a white potato. I'm going to stick this in a microwave. And then I'm going to make an egg scramble with bell peppers, of course, onions, mushrooms. I'm going to add some spinach. And we're going to do one egg and about six to seven ounces of egg whites. And then we got turkey bacon. Let me show you the turkey bacon. I had to throw it out, y'all. I found some new turkey bacon that tastes so good. It's the H-E-B Uncured. Y'all, that is the key to getting some good turkey bacon. It has to be uncured. If it's uncured, it literally tastes like crazy good. Now, curry bacon be cold, but they be having like a little taste that I really want not mess with. But I bought this because I saw one of my favorite fitness ladies recommend it. So I was like, let's, let's try it out. And she said she got us from Walmart. Walmart cheaper. This right here was like almost $4. The one from Walmart was closer to $3. So pick or choose what you want to do. But just make sure it's uncured. So while I'm cooking that, I'm going to be, uh, well, once my breakfast finished, I'm going to sip on my Create. I'm going to mix it with a crystal light. If you have not learned about this product, 
Creatine is very, very helpful with building muscle mass, increasing muscle performance, your physical performance, performing well in the gym, your endurance, your strength, your power to make you perform better. It don't matter when you take it. I take it after my workout, but you can take it before or after. It really doesn't matter. And I get it from EHP Labs. Y'all already know the drill, but I take this every day. And so y'all know I'm about to get ready to go out of town, so you know it's coming with me period so i'm about to slice and dice these pimples up make this breakfast and i'm gonna show y'all the finished product because So here is the finished product, y'all. This is very, very, very volume eating. This is what it's giving volume eating. Like getting a lot more for less calories. I could have easily ate a bagel and a couple of eggs. And it would have been like the same amount of calories. But I literally would have been hungry in the next hour or so. I really been trying to focus on more volume eating to just suppress my appetite a little bit. To feel, you know, satisfied. Because your girl got a big appetite. Baby girl can eat. Alright, so we about to dive in now. Alright, you guys. Still looking crazy, but now it is lunchtime. It is now 2.50. So, I told y'all, like, I literally didn't have an appetite for this long time. So, now I'm about to make some chicken tenders, some barbecue beans that I picked up from this barbecue place. Beans are out of this world. I'm probably off the calories just a tad bit, but that's cool. We're going to work with it. And then I'm going to mix some rice with it. And then I'm also going to eat chicken tenders again later. So I'm just going to make, I got five ounces for this serving and then five ounces later. So I'm just going to make them all in one bulk just to cut down on the cooking time. Put them in the air fryer on 380 for 12 minutes. I don't flip them over. So we're about to season these chicken, do what I do, what I do and I'm going to show you how the finished product. Let's get to eating. Right, you guys, so here's the finished product. It might look a little, little funny, but y'all, this has been my favorite addicting combo. It's high in protein because of the beans and the chicken. And then the, the rice just gives it more volume because, baby, I will fill this whole bowl up with them beans. That's how good they are. But, love it. About to smash. Meal two of the day. All right, you guys. I've made it home from worky work. Still looking cray cray. But, hey, it is what it is. And it ain't what it ain't. We doing what we doing. Yay. So, it is dinner time. So, if you do it, have not figured that out. I really like to eat breakfast at any time of the day. And plus, breakfast just gives me more volume, less calories, so that's what I go with. So, I still have my chicken tenders to eat, and I'm going to make me an omelet with lots of veggies, spinach, mushrooms, and one slice of turkey bacon. really wanted to, but I'm going to tell y'all why. 
So, this dinner really don't have no carbs except for the vegetables. But I don't really count the vegetables. But I'm going to tell y'all why dinner don't have no carbs. So, I, I, I mentioned that it was almost that time to lunch. So, it's this one little treat that I like to eat when it get that time. And I ate it so fast, I couldn't even show y'all a video of it. But I'm going to tell y'all what it is. Now, let me just forewarn you. You got to have some discipline. Because sometimes I be want to make me a whole jar of it and eat it like that when I get in my mode. But I don't do that. So, what it is, it is, y'all, I take a half, a serving and a half of raw cookie dough by Pillsbury. Put it in the cup. And I take half a serving of this Biscoff cookie butter, put that in a cup, and top it off with some whipped cream. And when I say it is like chef's kiss, it's an addiction. So, you don't want to be addicted, stay away from it. But if you want to try it out, try it out. So, half a serving of this is probably like uh, 120 so this part is like a, close to like 300 calories. It's like 300 calories, give or take. If I don't go crazy with the cookie dough, give or take 300 calories. I measure this and then I put 15 grams, which is half a serving. This cookie butter is so good. If y'all heard about these, it's the plain cookies, but it's the cookie butter. And I like to put this on my bagels in the morning. Oh, I don't even know why I smelled that, baby. I've been amazing another another serving. But, yeah, that's what I ate earlier, which took up all my carbs that I had planned for dinner, which was just going to be some jasmine rice, a whole bunch of rice, which would have really did it. But I had a decision to make, and I went for the cookie butter. So, not as much volume as we talked about earlier, but just enough to satisfy that craving and get a girl what she wanted. So, I'm about to make this omelet and warm up these chicken tenders, and I'm going to show you all the finished product, and that's going to be it for today. So, yup, let me hurry put this cookie dough up, but get eight. All right, you guys. So, this is this our dinner coming tonight. It's giving brunch. Brunch and munch. We got three chicken tenders. It's probably a little over five ounces because I just took um, a two out for earlier. And then I got 7.5 ounces of egg whites, a lot of peppers and onions and mushrooms, 16 grams of mozzarella cheese, and one slice of turkey bacon. High in protein. Let's talk about it. I'm going to throw down, y'all. So, with that being said, that concludes my what I eat today. I'm about to drink, finish drinking my water. I actually drank my gallon pretty fast today. So, I'm probably going to go over. Yep, that's what it's giving. I'm going over. But, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If y'all tried some of the meals, let me know what y'all think. I want y'all about that cookie dough and that biscuit butter. So, don't don't say I didn't want y'all. All right. But, with that being said, y'all already know the drill. Come back and message your girl. Peace out.